Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to another one minute tip episode. Uh, I'm actually gonna have like two tips in this one. And the first one is noticing behavior changes in your opponent. As you saw a little earlier, me and Yorick kind of kept a respectful distance to each other. But suddenly he started going in front of the minions a lot more and trying to get to me or seemingly changed his behavior to be more aggressive. And this sudden change obviously suggests to me that there is a gank coming. Even though he started doing that a little bit before Elise even got close, it was still very obvious and very typical behavior of your opponent when they're receiving a gank. So being aware of those behavior changes can really help you out. And I feel like not enough people do this and that's why sometimes you can get away without relying on wards. Because a lot of people do have behavior changes when they're receiving a gank or receiving help. So it's very, it's very easy to pick this up if you're paying close enough attention. And for the next tip, it's more to be prudent with your abilities, and I will show you what I mean by that. Alright, so right here I'm pretty close to level 8. I know that I'm gonna hit level, sorry, level 9. I know that I'm gonna hit level 9 before Yorick, because I had frozen the lane um, the last time he left the lane, and as soon as I hit level 9, that's when I go for the all-in. And I'll get very close to killing him, but he flashes away. If I flashed after him, I would have not really finished him because he would have de uh, healed up a lot from his Q. And I had no abilities up, so I would have to rely on my auto attacks. And Aurelia doesn't really do that well with auto attacks. And so I'm going to recall. He's going to push the lane in into my turret, but that's okay because I got his flash. And his flash is on a very long cooldown, and so is mine. So it's better that I save my flash and not waste it. Now we'll see what happens because of that. He has no flash, so he's a sitting duck. I'm going to set up these minions so I don't have to use my flash. And he will make out an easy kill for me. As you saw there, he didn't have any. F he didn't have his flash up because of that previous all in, and I was easily able to kill him right after. And I still have my flash up, so I'll be able to use it in a more pressing scenario. And I pretty much saved myself a very long cooldown on my summoner spell. Well, his is gonna be down for like another minute or two, even 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 after this. All in where I killed them, even though he used it in the all in way before. Alright, guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Have a great day and great night, and I'll see you tomorrow.